G'day everybody. Well, I got some of these earlier this week. They're high intensity discharge lamps, HID lamps, out of spectroscopes, which are used to uh, demonstrate different light colours and patterns in the uh, light spectrum. But uh, I just figured I'd uh, do a video on them and actually try one on the ZVS and just see what kind of outputs we can get off of them. I've got three different types. This one's sodium, but I've got neon and mercury metal halide lamps as well. Uh, of course, to get these to run properly, you need a ballast box, which I will be uh, looking out for. There's a junk shop nearby to where I live, which I'm going to uh, check out because they sell all sorts of industrial lighting equipment. So I might be able to pick one up pretty cheaply there and stick one of these in it and just see what kind of a uh, effects we can get but since I've got so many of them as then I've got another four of them here including these ones I just figured let's nuke one on the ZVS and just see what kind of colors we can get I'm actually quite curious about this okay we're all set up and ready for a test remember safety glasses when you do this I'm not 100% sure on what will happen uh, the lamp may explode and in that case it will be a fail video but I'll still upload it anyway because it's it would be funny, but let's give it a shot. This is a neon bulb first. Yep. Striking a half decent arc. I don't want to do it for too long because it will melt the solder base that's on the end of the cap because I still want to be able to use these lamps afterwards. That's actually quite impressive. Very carefully pick the camera up. Brightest down this end here where the uh, tungsten electrode is. It's actually quite cool. Okay then, now for a sodium. Let's unplug safety first. Discharge as Larry HXDFHOS says. Safety first. Okay, this is a sodium. Let's see what'll happen. Get in focus first. Ah, oh, it's just Corona. Still pretty impressive. I know we're running out of battery. Yeah, you can see there's little bits of our. Uh, let's not plug it. There's bits of our uh, sodium deposited on the end of the uh, the arc tube, so it's it's not like the neon where it was a vapor. It's all uh, solid, unfortunately. But uh, it was still pretty cool, though. I don't think I will do mercury because in case the lamp does shatter, I don't want mercury vapor in here because I don't actually have a proper fume extraction system yet. I don't want to end up breathing in any mercury vapor because it's rather nasty stuff. I know Photon doesn't really give a shit about any of that, but I'm not exactly Photon, am I? But uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching.